Well, I officially don't know what the hell I'm doing. So here's some context. About a week ago, uh, my supervisor told my group, uh, department, whatever you want to call it, um, that the company that we work for was going to be um, instituting uh, a 95% reduction in the workforce. It's not completely surprising given who this company is. I'm going to leave out their name for obvious reasons, but suffice it to say they're they're not worth losing all this street all this sleep and you know stressing about, but still it sucks. It absolutely sucks. Um I've I've never been on the, this side of layoffs before. Uh, my wife has unfortunately gone through two of them in the in the retail realm, and those were uh, pretty hard to deal with. Just seeing her entire world kind of unravel before her eyes. Um, uh, so now I get to experience that too. Now the the small <laughs> small silver lining. Um, is that my job for right now is safe. Don't know for how long. Um, and that, I, I mean, I guess on one hand, having my job be safe should be comforting, but the fact that um, we were originally part of the layoffs and were uh, spared from that, um, it doesn't make me feel any better. Not even a little bit. Um, Mostly because it's like, well, <laughs> clearly we're just as expendable. So, um, yeah. So ever since last week, I've been doing a lot of uh, soul searching, figuring out what my next move is. Um, yeah, looking online for jobs isn't so much like... Um, just uh, clicking apply and hoping for the best. Um, you know, I, I have to apply for stuff that I know I am capable of doing, and that's really, really hard because my skill set is so specific that I can't really apply it anywhere that isn't going to be like my my job could be done by AI within the next couple of years. Like it's going to happen. It's it's completely terrifying. It is completely terrifying to be in this position. Um, you know, my my job uh, has been consistent and constant for the past twelve years. You know, um, so to be in a position of I don't know what is gonna happen tomorrow is extremely frightening. And the really frustrating part is that these layoffs could have been completely um, avoided, but they were intentional. Um, this company had virtually every uh, um, every intention to get rid of the company my company that they bought um, right from the get-go so if we hadn't been bought or sold ourselves to this company um, none of us would be in this position so I don't know what I'm gonna do and that's utterly terrifying <laughs>